Hello everybody, it's me, it's Farum. We're back with some more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor. We're gonna do a we're gonna do a pain parade challenge. Haven't done one of these for a while. We're gonna do it with one of the weapons that everyone thinks it's probably not possible with, including myself. We're, we're gonna try it with the impact axes. This is probably attempt number twelve or thirteen. I can't remember. I've lost count. Um was trying it with the interrogator. That was going terribly, so we're gonna actually try it with a strong arm driller and see if we can uh, we can get some headway with this class. The the strong the, the interrogator just completely nerfs the axe um the axe overclocks the one that gives fire damage i thought he'd buff it the status effects from it but you know he just nerfs the whole thing it does like no damage at all the axes can't one hit the crabs or anything um but the the, the damage from the fire does scale with the axe damage so we're going to be pushing for axe damage there we have to take that reload speed because Pain Parade Challenge, if you see an upgrade for the weapon you've chosen, you're not allowed to pick something else. Even though that 10 luck would have been really, really nice. Uh, we need to get more gold. We haven't got enough. Give me crabs. There'll be lots more gold left looking around, though. Nitro has no value. We won't be using the shop, so... Uh, shop is banned. One heal before the last floor is all you're allowed. Nitro is nice to get for experience, but we need to get gold now because of, because of coming up to this point where we um, we have to re-roll for a fire weapon. And we're going to go for the Krakatoa Sentinels. A bit more gold up here. That's good. <laughs> Definitely need it. Uh, I don't need to swarm right now. I need that flyer to not be so close to me. That works. It no longer existing works quite well. Uh, so we'll take that damage. We need to get the fire upgrade. We don't need to get a level 6. We need to get a level 6 or 12. And there is a chance we don't get it. Right, there's a bit more gold. A lot more gold, actually. We can take some crit chance there. That will help with the axe damage. It's going to be its, its primary hit that's going to be doing a lot of the damage for us. Which is awful, because the primary hit of the axes is bad. Gold hit. Probably be all of it from this floor. Right, we'll take the reload speed. Got fire damage. So unfortunately, on the weapon card, we can't see how that scales up, but it does scale up because I've either got I've got that card quite a few times with different levels on the axes, and the damage numbers are different. So it does scale. Uh, we'll grab some pickup radius. That's going to be really useful. And we have to take that fifteen percent damage, but that's okay. We've got a roly boy. These are literally the worst. With this build, they are actually the worst. Uh, we can take that status effect damage. That will help the Krakatoa Sentinel turrets. They're, they're pretty good, even at level 1. Oh, and some 50% crit damage that we're allowed to take as well. It's quite juicy. I will take a reroll here, and we'll take some more... Yeah, some more crit damage. I think we've already got 9%, so yeah, we've got some crit chance. Oh god, he just... I shouldn't, I shouldn't have looked. <laughs> that was a bad time to look at anything. We don't want any of those. We do want the fire grenade. And then the collect wave cook is the last thing we want. But we need to try and get these. Where's the other? One of the bosses is stuck somewhere by the looks of it. We can take more crit chance. Oh no. Oh no, there's two roly boys. There's there's two. One of them was stuck somewhere. Uh, this is really bad. <laughs> Maybe we can get this one cooked. But there we go. There we go. That one should drop just from the status effect damage. And if we can get these explodey boys on this one, we'll be okay. Um, I think we keep going in on some crit chance. Try and make the most of that 50% crit damage that we got. Alright, well, I think we're out of explodey boys now. So we're just going to have to try and get close to him and drop some turrets off near him. Just need him to stand up. There you go. I think he's standing on a couple of flame puddles there. Could be him done. 
We have to take the plus two levels. It's a shame. We grab this health, though. Oh, no, that's that. Well, we're going to lose all that health we just picked up because I've got to run right the way around the entire map. Take the status effect damage. Take the 2% move speed, but not the plus one beams on the Cracker Tower. I felt bad. I felt really bad. I bet that one beam level would have probably won us this whole game. It would have done more than every the rest of every upgrade we get for the act. That one beam level. We're not actually at the shop. The shop's banned. Now you can hear the sadness in my voice. I hope it's coming across. I, I feel it in my soul. If you're enjoying this video, by the way, guys, please don't forget to give me a like. It really helps the video, especially with a small channel like this. It really does. And if you're really enjoying it and you're not already... Maybe give me a subscribe. Make videos most days. Have live streams. Wednesdays and Sundays. Come around. Say hi. We're normally playing this. Playing a lot of this at the moment, actually. This looks like there's some really fun things coming down the coming down the line in the next update. And some good stuff going on in the community. Although, got to probably take a look at Deep Rock Galactic at some point. The original, I mean. Not the Survivor's one. Just because, you know, it had a huge update today. And I do have the game. And I've almost finished the tutorial. I got this game first. I've only been playing this. All right, so we're in a we're in a we're in a bit of a rough spot here. We don't we don't want to be here. So we're going to leave. Uh, we don't really. But they've got these huge gaping caverns on these maps. It's very very unfair. It's like the game's trying to make me have a really bad time. What I really need now is experience. Shame you can't knock the bugs into the holes with the impact axes and they just disappear. That would certainly give them an interesting edge. Ah, oh, some experience dropped. Lovely. One day, perhaps more will drop. There we go. There's some more. Oh, we can take more status effect damage. Let's do that. Reroll here. Trouble damage is fine. We'll affect the axes and the fire damage from the axes, weirdly enough. Okay, that was really unfair. Well, it wasn't. It was just the axes doing axe things completely as normal. Oh, we need some Bulo caps. Oh, God. Almost was horrible. I don't want that fire weapon. On this one. This one's the best one. Uh, we don't want any of that. Uh, we'll take the move speed though. That will help us. As we have to spend longer on floors later. Or even now potentially. We're, we're kind of stuck. Reroll that. We'll take more. Oh, I have to take the damage. Already made that mistake and ended one run. Oh, not another roly boy. Why are you doing this to me? Hit the plus two. I want the damage and the reload speed. I, I, I need them hitting hard. I can stay close to stuff and get the axes thrown. That's not a problem. I haven't seen a magnet this floor. Flames, uh, flames aren't even reaching in there. Victorian's almost downed already. It's the difference. The Roly Boy is just such chaos. Such absolute chaos, the Roly Boys. Find him. Find him. Turrets. 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 No! Three turrets on him. More turrets on him. Roll around the circle, okay. I'll give some more damage. 
We need to we need to we need to get him a bit. Uh, we are getting him a bit. He's on fire. It shows I can see he's on fire. So keep him in the wave cooker, keep him in the wave cooker. Uh, he's still ticking away. He's still on fire. Should be him. Maybe. Why is it going to put the drop pod? Over there, of course. I'll take the pickup radius. One of these is a magnet. I picked I picked wrong. The one down here is the magnet. Guys, can we get to this magnet and get back? You think? We can take that HP. This is a bit of a run here, guys. Explosive damage. We need that move speed right now. We need that damage. I had to run through the bugs. I had no other choice. I probably did actually just have another choice, but I didn't think I didn't feel like I did in that second. All right, we've got really shit health. That's really bad. We're not allowed to use the shop, so we can't buy a heal. But we're on to wave three. We would like to heal. That's our objective. Our objective is heal and find some red sugar and some gold and some healing. This would be much easier with artifacts, I must say. This is quite a brutal challenge, but if we can do it with this. I didn't think it was possible with a minigun, and someone posted a, a screenshot of the forums having done it with a minigun. They did like 40 million damage. I don't know how much move speed they ended up on, but they must have had a lot. Or playing on a controller, I'm, I'm not sure. I, 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 there's no way I tried it on a keyboard. I just I couldn't, didn't have the turning circle. To deliver the damage. But yeah, the damage, damage is looking okay for floor three. Looking all right. Not killing bosses very fast, but they are dying. Um, we will take some more crit chance. But we need to pick up flowers. We don't need to, but we probably should. It's a lot about, I think, just trying to keep the horde slimmed down and with our short range axes. Staying close is, is what we have to do. Uh, we'll take some more pickup radius. I feel like we've got enough, but... Flowers over here. We're very fast. <laughs> That's good. Oh, they're all stuck on a loot bug. They're just stuck pushing the loot bug towards us. Nice. Big explosion there. More damage. We'll have our extra axes soon. That level up came just in time to push the push the bugs back there. Take that reload speed. There's a magnet there. Oh crap! We picked it up. Take some more move speed. It might help us at the end. I don't believe there was an axe upgrade there. If there was, I've just bugged up another run. Someone will tell me if I messed up. Someone will point it out. I'm sure. Are we going to just go? Outrun the explosion. It's fine. Uh, ooh. We have some more crit chance. That weapon range would be useful. We will take it. We've already got the magnet from this floor. Please no roly boy. Oh my god. That's a roly boy on every floor. This has literally been my entire night. It's just been battling with Roly Boys. I mean, I just want one easy floor, guys. They're insisting on giving me their hardest battles, man. Not fair. Oh, we can take that range. Let's take it. This this is gonna it's gonna be helpful. I think the Explody Boys just went off on the Roly Boy. We'll take a reroll here. We'll take 10% more damage. I'm not even that bothered about getting the access to 18. It's not like, I feel like, really important. I would like to get the um, Explody Boys on the Rolly Boy, really. Yeah. Uh, we have to reroll here. 
we'll re-roll again. We have to take the axes. Right, we've got our extra axe, axes for axe time. So if we get stand there, and then he should roll this way, and then edge, and yes! Good. Oh, I have to rewrite. Right? My cats are having a war. Cats, stop it. No war time. Only time for war on the bugs, not war with each other. Come on now. As if they don't know there's important stuff going on on Hox's 4 or something. I wonder what happened to Hoxus 1 to 3. That might be talked about in the main game. I'm just not aware. Did the dwarves fully mine it out? Or. I don't know. What's our move speed up to for floor 4? Up to 38% move speed. That's quite juicy. I look, all the flowers all right here. Just ready for us to grab. The wave cooker range is quite nice. We. We might be able to win it mostly with that. The axe is hitting for a huge uh, 1,000 on its crit. Very big. I uh, honestly, I don't know if this is possible. I've been trying several, several. I've been trying for three and a half. Wow. I've been trying for this for three and a half hours. <laughs> it's kind of dark. My videos have been light as of recent. What's going wrong, little cat? We can take that 10 luck. We're not going to. We'll just reroll. And again, I'd like to see something that increases my damage significantly. That would actually increase my damage quite significantly. Because that will get the reload speed of this down quite a lot. Because we're not going to get down any other way. And those, those turrets deal a lot of damage. Oh god, the axes. Come on, guys. Just the amount they pull the the mob, mobs is really crazy sometimes. As soon as the explodey boys go off in this wave, there's going to be another wave. I was hoping that might be health. But it was not. Come on, just get the other wave in. I just want the other wave to spawn. Yeah. It can all come charging in at super speed to us. It's fine. Take some more damage. Need every scrap we can get. Oh, we should be okay to stand. Uh, there we go. The explodey boys just went off. Uh, we'll take the re-roll. We have to take the axe. Another swarm. It's the last swarm we have to deal with, though. Fight it here for a little bit. I need more explodey boys to go off. Like right now, more explodey boys. Okay, we're re rolling. Yep, yeah, we'll take the reload speed of all. Please, no rolly boy. Just this one floor without a rolly boy would just be absolutely delightful. Yeah, there's no rolly boy. We've got two small crabs, I think, instead. Right, we're going to take some more explosive damage. We really need to try and manage our health now. Take some more armor. Get some health down here. We'll mine that up. Got the explodey wave coming in. Please don't drag the monsters towards me, guys. Come on. We've spoken about this. I only want them pushed away. There we go. Nice. Got a magnet. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, we'll go for some more reload speed. Now let's try and get out of here without getting hit. How was there experience left over here when I just got a magnet? Strange, eh? Strange. 
All right, we're on stage five. It's the Dreadnought stage. We need to prepare accordingly. How do we prepare accordingly in a 5S pain parade challenge? That's right, guys. We press the continue button. And if you're still here at this stage and you haven't done already because it was full screen and you couldn't draw yourself away from it while it's boring now, go and smash that like button. Smash it. so much. Thank you. Kisses and hugs. I'm sweating, by the way. This is... Right, so we don't really want to spend too much time messing around on this floor. We kind of just want to go and get... get Get shit done, basically. Um, the longer we stay, the more damage we'll take. Yes, that was nice. Oh, look, all the bugs are in one. All of these are in one place, so we can just come and drop some turrets in the middle of it. I, that might work. Might not work. I'll have to break this one first. Single targets, not great. This is where the wave cooker would um would come in come in nifty. Not the wave cooker, being the interrogator. Right, there's that one done. And this one, this one, go on. Get it. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm going to have another bit of a go at this one. Just need to drop a turret next to this one, it'll burn. There you go. Right, one more to go. There it is, right. Get on it. Good. I'll grab this health, and get the dreadnought out. Dreadnoughts. Is it one or two, guys? Place your bets in the comments below. And this is it. The, the, the run's almost over because I'm probably not going to win this against the bloody single Dreadnought. Anything we can to put a bit more damage on him. Oh, this is really not a good place to be. This is why it's sort of useful to explore the map before you start the Dreadnought fight. <laughs> He's almost, we've taken off maybe 10% of his health. If I can hit him with a supply pod, I deserve to hit him with a supply pod. Otherwise, I don't think we're going to do it. I won't pick up the supply. Good chance. Right, that's going to have helped us massively. There's no way the axes could have killed him, guys. I, I, I'm sorry. I'm sure you wanted to see me kill him with just the axes, but he would have killed me. I could tell. I can tell from that amount of damage that we were doing. I think even now I'm going to be like. <laughs> yeah, even. I'm going to take the move speed. He needs to leap at me. Yeah, good. So he needs to be closer so we can actually hit him with some stuff. Hit him with the axes, maybe. Is he gonna love tunnel again? Probably. I think I think most of the damage we're doing to him is actually from the um actually from the status effects. I don't think the axes are even hitting him at all. Something hit him there for some damage, maybe an axe. Series of axes, maybe. I think he's I think this is spicy. I think he one shots me by the way. With a jump. We need to move away a bit, make sure we don't pick up the supply and invalidate our run. Watch it. 
I haven't seen the um oh, we're gonna take the HP. He hasn't got much health left. But honestly, nor do we. It's a bit spicy, guys. He only needs to take a little, he just needs to stand a little bit more fire. He needs to stand in a little bit more fire. I don't want him to grow stronger. I just want him to stand in a little bit more fire. Well done, team. I need to get out of here. <laughs> oh my god. I need to get out. Oh. oh, that was so hard. Guys. Oh, that was so difficult. Guys, I really hope you enjoyed that run because that was a long one in the making. That one really was. And that was really difficult. That was really hard. That was... The impact axes need... They need something. But anyway, there's the impact axes. Pain parade. Challenge done. The only thing... The only weapon that's not been done by the community now is the shock drones, I believe. Um, I don't think I'm going to be trying those. I'm looking forward to when the next patch comes out and we can try some new stuff and have a look at some of the new stuff. Anyway, yeah. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. Hope to catch you on a live stream, either on a Wednesday or a Sunday, or see you in the comments of the videos. I always try to respond. Have a good one. Catch you later. Oh, before we go, this is what the axe stats ended up looking like. Bad. Terrible. 100% terrible. Goodbye.